first time about uh, th three and a half years. So we, we, we got this uh, lovely lady uh, back with us here in the Bay Area. The, the, this is uh, Deanne from Zandria. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Yeah, so good to see you again. Likewise. Yeah. So lovely for you to take the time. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, well, I definitely had, had to have you, have you back. I, I, mean, I mean, I wasn't aware you guys were doing your first headlining tour across the States. We are, indeed. We have five shows left, including tonight. And um, so far, it, it has been wonderful. We've had great turn-ups and uh, people really partying along. And uh, I'm very grateful. Yeah, because yeah, because when, when the last time I interviewed, it was your first time ever touring the U.S. and you were the openers doing a half-hour set. Yeah, true. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And, and so, so it almost seems like almost kind of brave for you to, for, for, for a band that had never toured the States before to come, come even though you have a long history uh, and a lot of albums out, uh, to just come do your first full-scale headlining right away after that. Well, kind of, kind of, agree. I agree yeah. that it's brave and it's bold, but it seems to work out, so... It's been a few years, and you have you've done three actual releases with, with, with Zandria. I mean, how has your life changed being the singer in Zandria? I love being the the face of the band. Um, I love being on social media and and talking to my fans, um, most direct. And so many people support us, support me, and um, well, I'm just very grateful for everyone out there who loves our music as much as we do. Because I'm very aware that without our fans, we couldn't do this, and I wouldn't be where I am now. When so long with destiny, that was This album is, 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 is quite, quite, quite the uh, ep epic uh, musical piece of tunes. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. I think so as well. I think, well, I'm obliged to say so, but I, I do believe that it's our best album. Is there a real uh, concept going with the whole thing? Uh, no, no. We get this question a lot, but uh -huh. there's not. Though you could say that, of course, because it has so many colors, that those are the dimensions that we chose to put out there, and they're bundled into a theater, yeah. which leads to Theater of Dimensions, yeah, a title. You had a lot of special guests on it, too. We did. We have four guest singers. Mm -hmm. We have Ross Thompson from Van Canto, Henning Busser from Mayen and Firewind, uh, Björn from uh, Soilwork, and um, Zahir Zurgati from Marith. And, and uh, you, you, you got like a choir in there, too? Yes, uh, it's the Padam Choir from Amsterdam, and they also were on our Sacrificium recording. Mm -hmm. It's a professional choir, and they do a wonderful job. <laughs> Title track of the album, you know, the long epic trap. I mean, that is a masterpiece. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that song is just so. I mean, just, just blew me away the first time I listened to it. Mm -hmm. it just really, just, they're, they're, it's, it's such a performance with everybody involved. I mean, I mean, it's definitely its, its own opera. 
It is. Well, it's a mini musical, mini opera. Yes, that's yeah. true. It's divided in, in a few um, actors. Mm -hmm. and that's how you call it an opera. I'm not sure if you know what this yeah. is in English. Acts. Acts? Oh, it's the same thing. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's very, very, very good to see you again on Reality Check. Good luck on the rest of the tour, and you know, rock San Francisco tonight. I will. I will. Thank right, you very good much. To see you again.